Hi guys, it's Lara from TooFatFromFatFitness.com and it has been a long, long time since I've made a video for you guys and so I just wanted to make a little update uh, video, kind of let you guys know where I've been, what's going on and what you can expect from me in the future. Am I going to be coming back and start vlogging again regularly? Yes. Yes, I promise I am. Life has just been absolutely hectic. It started with the holidays and then it was my birthday and then all these different things and we just found out like two and a half weeks ago that we were moving this weekend. So to say the least, the last few weeks have been extra hectic and stressful. And I'm also um, helping organize a huge event that's going on at the end of the month here. Um, uh, the 21 day fix trainer autumn Calabrese is coming to Calgary and we have like 550 people coming. It's huge, huge, huge event. So that's, you know, taking up a bit of time as well. <laughs> and it's been overwhelming and stressful and exciting all at the same time. As you guys know, I'm an emotional eater, so this is a very, very, very struggling um, month for me. But I gotta say, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm pretty, you know, taking the good with the bad. Like, I, there's been a lot of times where I've fought off the urge to eat just due to feeling overwhelmed and excited and stressed and all these things all at once and being so busy and that. Um, I have successfully fought that urge off quite a bit. Um, there have been times that I've given into it as well. I'm not perfect, but at least I'm not gaining weight. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> um, that's pretty much where I'm at right now. I'm, I'm not gaining any weight. I have not gained any weight in this whole thing. Um, and I won't, uh, I'm going to lose weight. So my max 30, that's what I'm doing right now. I'm doing insanity max 30. It's a, there's a brand new workout program. And I think I talked about it a little bit when I first started or right before I started it. Um, I am actually in week, six now six yeah I have two and a half weeks holy crap I have two and a half weeks left of max 30 and it's just gone by so fast and I just love it and I seriously I want to do it again like I'm already planning after these two and a half weeks are up I just want to do it again um, I feel like it is definitely the most efficient workout that's how I feel about it when people ask me about it I say it is the most efficient workout because Although um, I have been making my good choices uh, alongside the bad here and there and stuff, um, Max 30, like overall, especially in the last week, and it's going to be pretty much the same until we're moved this weekend, um, I've not been eating typically as clean as I usually do. And the reason for that is because we're trying to eat all the food out of our house that we possibly can, right? So we're like emptying our freezer and we're emptying our, our fridge and our pantry. And I, like, I have my boundaries. I mean, and we don't have like a lot of bad food in the house anyways, but it's kind of making it a little bit more tricky to kind of then um, normally to stick to my normal meal plan because there's, you know, burgers in the freezer that need to get eaten, you know, and, um, we have a whole bunch of spaghetti, like whole wheat spaghetti. So it's not that bad, but I typically avoid pasta because it's just so heavy. Um, it's just, you know, we had it in the pantry because there's like one time, I guess, where we were going to have spaghetti, but we're trying to get rid of it. So, you know, we had spaghetti the other night, which is so odd for me. Like I say, um, you know, I'm still keeping my portions under control and, and those sorts of things, but but yeah, it's been, you know, just, I'm not eating like I normally do. Like I've been eating granola bars because we got so many granola bars and, um, you know, my daughter can only eat so, so many of them. So things like that have kind of like, I don't want to buy, we're basically have for the last couple of weeks, we've been like, we're not buying any new food. We have been buying fresh fruit and vegetables still. So I've still been having like my omelets for lunch with my fresh veggies in them and stuff. So I'm still making sure to get my fresh, fresh vegetables as well. But like for dinner and stuff, it's like all frozen veggies. And some of them aren't the best. Like, uh, we had this huge bag of frozen veggies that had peas and corn and stuff in it, peas and corn and carrots. And normally I wouldn't have that as a vegetable with my dinner. Like normally I would have like a green vegetable, um, with my dinner. So things like that is just a little bit different. It's been a little bit off. Um, but anyways, what I'm getting at is that with max 30 and considering how I've been eating and all these struggles I've been going through and stuff like that, if you're not following me on Instagram or Facebook, I posted up, 
but I guess it was a week and a half ago now, I posted up my um, end of week four quote unquote 30 day results, even though they weren't really 30 days, it was four weeks. But anyways, I posted my day 30 results with max 30, my midway results. And I was absolutely freaking blown away because you know what, that scale did not move at all since the beginning, I think three pounds, um, since the beginning of the program, but holy crap, like those pictures are insane. Like I was like, Oh, I did not know I was that round when I started it. And I also didn't really realize just how much my stomach has flattened out since I've done it. And that's with, like I say, less than perfect nutrition. So, um, so we're moving, um, we're actually moving into my parents' place temporarily, um, just to save a bit of money up, um, to buy a place in the next three to five months. So it's just kind of, you know, we've already been saving to buy a place and then everything, the stars all aligned. Um, our landlord here is actually selling this place and our lease is coming up. And so it all just aligned that it was like, okay, we have to move out of here anyways. And this could really just fast track our house savings. The economy here is totally declining. House prices are dropping. Um, so, so it all just lined up, all the stars lined up. So that's what we're doing. We're moving in with my parents. So space for working out at home at my parents' place is going to be an issue. But let me tell you, I'm not stopping my max 30. Um, I will continue. I am finishing for sure those last two weeks. And I don't care if I need to, like, work out in front of everybody. I don't, I don't know what I'll do. But I, I'll be able to find the space. And then, um, yeah, and then I really want to, like I say, just do another round of Max 30, but have my nutrition dialed in because we'll be there for at least two months. So um, we shouldn't be doing any moving and blah, 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 blah in those next two months. So um, that's kind of my loose plan, but I don't know. I might do the 21 Day Fix Extreme after <laughs> I haven't really decided yet, but I'm just, like I say, I feel like max 30 is just the most efficient. I mean, it's just 30 minute workouts and I just feel like it's the most efficient workout program that I've ever done. So that's where I'm at. I'm just basically trying to stay sane in this month of craziness because, um, yeah, I'm planning that I'm helping plan that huge event at the end of the month. Plus I'm planning a five-year-old birthday party because it's my daughter's birthday on the 22nd. So, um, yeah, so we don't actually have to be out of this place until February 28th, but 28th is the autumn event. And I was like, I'm absolutely not doing anything moving that weekend. Cause I'm totally busy that like whole weekend from Friday to Sunday with that event. So, so it was like, okay, maybe the weekend before that, but the weekend before that's my daughter's birthday, right? 22nd. So it was like, well, we're going to have to move like the, on Valentine's day. So we're moving Saturday on Valentine's day. It's a long weekend also. It's kind of nice to get it done a long weekend. And then I have a couple weeks after to come back and clean up and stuff like that. So anywho, so I've just been kind of trying to stay sane. And like I say, trying to make good choices, trying not to binge eat all the time. I have had a couple binges. I was so proud of myself because I had gone so long without binging and I did end up binging a couple times in the last um, like month or so just due to the overwhelming whatever. It's crap. Like it's like this is the thing. It's like excuses, excuses, shit's going on. Sorry for my language, but uh, they're like one day it's like I don't care how stressed out I am today. I absolutely 100% Blinders on, vision, eye on the prize. I am eating right. I'm sticking to my eating plan. I'm doing good um, as much as I can stick to it with, like I say, what we're eating because we're just cleaning our, our freezer and our pantry out right now. But still, I'm not going over my calories. Like that's kind of where my limit's been. Like I'm like, I'm counting my calories and I'm not going over my calories because, you know, I can't always, I can't really stick to like my servings of whatever when I'm when I'm just emptying out my pantry but I still can stick to my calories right and um and yeah so I have some days that are like and it's totally stressful it's like such a stressful busy crazy day but I stick to it and then the next day it's busy stressful whatever as well not anything worse but I'm just like Oh, whatever. And then I binge, but, um, thanks to max 30, I am going to survive this whole situation without gaining any weight because it is such an efficient workout program. That's how I feel about it. So that's been what's up with me going forward. Once we are moved into my parents' place and settled, 
Um, and this autumn event is done. <laughs> um, like, so starting in March, I am going to go back to doing my weekly compilation videos. So just kind of showing you guys my food, clips of my food throughout the week, clips of my workouts throughout the week, and uploading that like every Friday or Saturday or whatever, um, just because it helps me with accountability. And also I have received a lot of feedback from when I used to do those weekly compilations that you guys seem to really enjoy those too. So that's my plan. Cause once we are moved in and settled to my mom's house, I should have a little bit extra time um, in my week uh, once February is done. <laughs> so um, that's something that I definitely want to get back in doing because it really helped me. And I, I, like I say, I've heard feedback from you guys that that's what you enjoyed. Um, a couple of you have said like, oh, I really miss, you know, your week compilations. Like I did it all through Turbo Fire and a lot of you really enjoyed it. So that's my plan. Um, so yeah. So anyways, that's that guys. I'm so, so sorry that I've been so absent on my channel here lately, but I promise it's temporary and I am coming back. Okay guys, I will talk to you later.